everyone, it's Dreadly, and welcome to a state-of-the-art new episode. Today, I was looking for some fresh new music to add to my palette. So I do what every good new music listener does. I go on YouTube, and I look, and I search through the deep, dark depths of it. And I have scrounged up some of the most talented, some of the most trend-setting, some of the most fire music that YouTube has to offer. So without any future interruptions, exclusively on Dreadly TV, I give you Unicorns Killed My Girlfriend. Enjoy. Oh no, it's only four seconds in and I already know that these guys mean business. We got the gratuitous use of wallet chains, your sister's skinny jeans, and a Batman shirt matching Batman shirts. Never too many Batman shirts in a band. You gotta set the scene bar high in order to make it big. I can only imagine what was going on in these guys' heads. Okay, well, we got a killer new song, but no music video. I got my Samsung Galaxy, man. We can film on that. Well, where are we gonna film it? In my mom's garage and at the mall. Sweet. On top of all that, these motherfuckers have guns! That's right, Mom's Garage is in the middle of the ghetto. I mean, who's chaperoning these guys? We all know to be a great new band that's definitely in the scene, you need only the hottest EDM synth in the background. You need it to really push out that inner ego. Yes, I will always say you're an emo kid. Well, no. That's so 2006. I don't think you even know what emo means. You are far too young and far too privileged using your mom's paychecks to, uh, fund your little hobby. No, you have graduated to your new title. That one kid in that one band. Let's take a moment to count how many people feel out of place. <laughs> Side note, cargo shorts seem to be in season. Ah yes, Monster, the official trend-setting drink for all bands. Only to be drank while wearing Batman shirts. <laughs> Also, I just noticed something. Where's the drummer? Maybe it's this guy. I'm still wondering why he's waving a pistol around like a fucking orangutan. You're rocking clothes that I cannot afford. Don't you dare be throwing shade at my polo. It was $10 and it looks great. Also, I'm not wearing pants. Moving on. No, but seriously, man, if you're gonna sing about that shit, you better come in with some Gucci, some Prada, some fucking gold grills. You should not be wearing a Batman shirt, your sister's skinny jeans, and that checker belt you get in the clearance section at Hot Topic. Have some decency. Shop at Walmart, man. <laughs> Damn, that hair though, those are some glorious locks. If I was completely tone deaf, I would think this was a Slayer video. Also, what is this guy doing in this band? He's obviously the best one out of the bunch, he has the best guitar, he has his own style. I mean, why are you with these clowns, dude? If it were me, as soon as I found out that the video was being filmed at the mall and in the garage, I would be out. What are you doing? Stop trying to stick your head up your ass. Very unhealthy. Yeah man, just arrived in my mom's new car. You guys should listen to my band's new song. It's really good. I got it on CD. We can take a cruise and play it on repeat. Also, don't scratch the hood of your mom's car, Mr. Two Chains, Three Chains, whatever. She's gonna take away your microphone for a week. Ooh, mass 
massive brutality, flashing lights. I'm sorry, I'm fucking epileptic. There's really nothing special about this moment in the song. It sounds exactly like the last three minutes. Only difference is Mr. Three Chains isn't telling me how his Batman shirt is better than my polo. Yeah, we want this guy because he's so popular. I mean, he has it all. He has his mom's car, the most trend-setting threads, and a killer band. This guy, no, this man, is the real fucking deal. He is everything that I strive to be. Excuse me while I get some hair dye. Wait, what did he just say? I have no words. You're in the club, in this bitch. Well man, I hate to tell you this, but if you're in the club fooling around with emo girls, you won't be able to play your first show. Yeah, 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 we know. Party all night, sleep all day, too busy to play your first show. Well that, ladies and gentlemen, was Hate All You Want by Unicorns Killed My Girlfriends, the new upcoming and trendiest band of 2016. And yes, these guys are serious. So serious, in fact, that they have their own website. Let's go check it out. Well, we have a logo that was definitely created in freeware. I mean, look at it, all the same fonts. Ah, what am I kidding? It's the trendiest logo of all time. And here you have three clickable links. You can find their most killer music. Oh, it's on Spotify. Nice, nice. Too lazy. You can find their merch. Yeah, I'll stick to my $10 polo. I mean, what the hell is that? And their tour, or in music language, their shows. Wait, why can't I click on it? Oh yeah, I know now. They don't have any shows. I wonder why. Well, that's all we have for today. Give it up for the finest lads. Unicorns killed my girlfriends. If you ever start a new band, it's everything that you should strive to be. Down to the Batman shirts, the gratuitous use of chains, the black hair, and your mom's garage. Everything that you need in a band is right here, and you should follow their example. Well, like I said, that's all we got for today. If you like the content that I'm putting out, don't be afraid to hit the like button. If you want to see more of me, you should really subscribe. Also, if I get one dislike on this video, yes, one dislike, I'll fight Rey Mysterio. See you next time.